Rachel Holt for Nesson.com alongside Zach Cox here at Gillette Stadium on this beautiful fall day. The New England Patriots take on the New York Jets this Sunday at MetLife Stadium. Sole possession of first place in the AFC East is on the line in this one. These two division rivals, they know each other very well. One player in particular, a Jets player, Coney Ealy, who played for the Patriots, knows his opponent extremely well. Now Ealy says he still uses the advice Tom Brady gave him when they were teammates. Now he'll be using it against him. Yeah, uh, Coney Ealy gave an interview in the New York Post this week saying that during his, his brief time with the Patriots, he was only here for a couple months. He came here in March and didn't work out. He was ended up being out the door in, in August. But he was here for, for all of uh, OTAs, all of minicamp, all of training camp. And he said every day he would go up to Tom Brady and say, how do you, how, how can defense, defensive linemen fluster you? What's, what's, what should I put into my game that you wouldn't like facing? Now he's going to be facing him. So, and Coney Ealy didn't work out for the Jets, but he's looked, or didn't look out for the Pats, rather. Looked pretty good for the Jets so far. Well, not only will they have Coney Ealy flustering Brady, but Brady is also a little banged up. He yep. didn't participate in practice yesterday due to a left shoulder injury. It's his non-throwing shoulder, but at the same time, is there any reason to be concerned for Sunday? Uh, I don't think concerned for Sunday. Um, all the reports are that he's going to play. He's said that more than once that he's going to play, that he feels fine. Concern for Sunday, no, but concern for the future a little bit. I mean, Tom Brady can only continue to take this kind of punishment for so long. I mean, he's been sacked 16 times through five games. He's on pace to be sacked the most times in a single season in, in his career, and he's obviously been playing this game for a very long time. Now, he's a savvy veteran. He does know he, he's very good at, at falling on that, non, uh, on that non-throwing shoulder, kind of uh, protecting himself in, in the contact there. But if that shoulder continues to be sore, there's only so many times he can fall on that before it's, it ends up being a real problem and maybe he has to fall on his other shoulder. So this weekend, I don't think it's going to be any problem. I think he should be, should be playing and he, he should be perfectly fine. But they do have to, they have to find a way to protect him better, and that's going to be one of the big storylines moving forward. Hey, 40 years has to catch up to you at some time, doesn't <laughs> it, does. it? Now, interesting stat on this one. The Patriots have won 10 of their last 12 meetings against the Jets, so a pretty good record there. They'll try to add to it this weekend. You'll be at the game. So make sure you keep it on Nesson.com for all your Patriots news.